This next poem is for a friend of mine. I was up in Arkansas mining some quartz crystals out of Mount Ida. And uh, I met this kid named Dustin. He has Down syndrome. And what amuses me so much about special people is, is how we treat them and how we think of them. Because you know, if you find a special person, anybody know anyone who's special? Woo! But you know, if you're nice to them, they like you, right? Because you're nice. And if you're mean to them, well, they don't like you anymore because you suck because you're mean. But we, a smart people, spend lifetimes in relationships, friendships, and kinships with people who beat us, berate us, hospitalize us, demean us on a constant. They say they love us, and we believe them, and we stick around through the abuse, but have the nerve to call special people retarded. So this is for my friend Dustin. I hope I can be just like him one day when I grow up. See how you can trust in Dustin. He's got more chromosomes than I'd know what to do with. Coolest dude I met in all of Arkansas and a bull acting straight foolish. He saw my tattoo, splashed some water, put his horns up and said, Rock on, dude! And I could tell right away that his syndrome was down. But he didn't get down, just was down. Born down like 311 and James Brown. Dustin Woo! was it, son. His mother told me she envied his ability to love life, just live life so freely. He still gets mystified by butterflies and scenic scenery. He still smiles when he pops bubble wrap. Cardboard boxes are still forts to him. And that day was the first day he had been swimming ever. See, he was terrified of water, but Dustin was a five minute overcomer. Just like that, he was scared but tried it, tried it and liked it, liked it and loved it. Now he's a part of it. See, Dustin is a 17 year old splish splashing machine. He gave me a great big bear hug, pulled back, smiled and said, well, you sure are hairy. <laughs> and I laughed, then he laughed. And the trick was done. See, Dustin was an undiscovered street magician, but y'all don't tell anyone, because the world, it ain't ready for his powers. Y'all, he can melt Antarctica with a high five. He can make the sun smile every time he walks by. He's the only person I've ever met that I bet can understand what's being said when the trees speak. Some nights, him and the moon meets. In grassy Arkansas hill countries, they play hide and go seek. But if the moon can't break away from his night job, and Dustin's still alone, well, they make faces at each other through his bedroom window. You see, Dustin, Dustin can make the moon laugh. That's his superpower. It's what that 21st chromosome does for him. Down syndrome is an insult. Dustin's the brightest gemstone I found in all of Arkansas. And don't you dare call him stupid. That kid's got more cool than the Fonz would know what to do with. He's the definition of superhuman. So you can trust in Dustin to be a friend when you can't befriend yourself. Just don't hug him when you're wet. Because he doesn't like that. But he will hug you even if he's wet. Because Dustin thinks that's hilarious. And when Dustin laughs, he spins his arm and shaped thighs, tosses his head back and throws his body forward like he's never been so fully engulfed in a moment before in his life. But he has been. In fact, it was yesterday. But as simple as he is, Dustin understands the power of today. And today, he inspired a poet. Tomorrow, a painter. Thursdays were his work days. He gives away free hopes until his arms break. Giving all that he has, he doesn't know what it is to take. With no ulterior motives. Dustin couldn't be fake if he tried. And Dustin never needs an alibi. Because superheroes, well, they just do what comes natural to them. They save the world. One person at a time. So you can trust in Dustin too. Because that's what superheroes are for. Thank you guys. I'm Seth Walker. Y'all have been awesome. Woo! Shout out to the Bay, Dave Perez, Mike McGee, and all you out there at Summerfest. Thank you guys for joining us via web. Thank you, Salt Lake City, for having us. We'll be back somewhere around 9, 9.30-ish. Yes! <laughs>